So that, was, a, that it, was cool last night? It was great last <laughs> night. And in fact, I'm going to start off by, we were talking about seeing the movie last night. I'm going to pay you a compliment. Uh, it reminded me of the very first time I saw Avatar. And Whoa. I don't know if that was an inspiration for you. I, I really don't know. But if it was, I, I will tell you that I had the same kind of feeling. Cameron is, is a model for me, for sure. Mm -hmm. uh, he was a... Uh, kind enough and generous enough to invite me on the set of Avatar and he gave me a lot of tips from just from generosity he has nothing to do with the film he, he's just like a great guy and uh, yeah he's he's Usain Bolt you know so right the, the racer when yeah. You, yeah when you're a racer and you watch the video of Usain Bolt and then you say yeah I, I want to be silver medal <laughs> Forget about the gold, because well, you send gold, we'll have the gold. <laughs> kudos to you, because honestly, you delivered gold. And you have oh, before, of course, so we'll talk about Lucy in a minute, but I just, I, I really loved it. Now, you're a, you're a big, I love the shirt, you're a big sci-fi fan, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, because future, everything is possible, mm -hmm. you know, so you can, you can just go, you can fly, so... Why not? What, the origins of this story, this is one of your favorite comics, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, one of, I, I discovered at 10 years old, and 10 years old, you, you, I have one channel in black and white on TV, and I don't have a computer, no, not even a Walkman, you know, and, and I'm living at 30 kilometers from Paris, so in the countryside. So my only escape is these two pages of Valerian every week, you know, that I am in my, my little comic book, and there are two space agents traveling through space and time and kicking butt to aliens. Yeah, I, I'm in love, you know? And it was my only window to escape. So you have been working on this, it's safe to say, your entire life. This is like a dream project for you. Then. I, I really start working on it seven years ago when I say, okay, let's try. But I really remember the feeling, say, let's try. <laughs> because I was not even sure that it's possible to make. There's like thousands of aliens in the film, sometimes in different dimensions, so it, it's a nightmare to do. <laughs> well, actually, that was going to be one of my questions. The challenge is to do in a film, because visually, this thing is just a home run. It's stunning on the screen. You have to see it. See it on the biggest screen you can find, IMAX 3D. But what were some of the challenges to making it that big and that bright? It's to... Um you have to be surrounded by creative, generous, and good people. There is no way you can do it without that. So you have to you have to share the field. You know we are we are players on it, and you have to trust them. You have to create that, and that what that was the most challenging. You you can't be just the guy, you know, doing the thing. It's impossible. The creative people who make the drawings of all the aliens, they work for two years. They did. 7,000 drawings and they, the average was like 19 years old and they're coming from China, Brazil, US. It's a bunch of nerds, <laughs> totally not, you know, like not uh, feeling well on earth. They look, they're drawing like this. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? Nerds rule. <laughs> we have to talk about the cast and Dane and Kara. What drew you to, to, to them? I don't want the classical, I mean, for, for the main guy, I don't want the classical superhero, full of muscle, sure about himself. I want the guy who lie, you know? <laughs> he's pretentious, he's lucky. But in the same time, if he has to fight to save her, he will take two swords and he will fight any monsters in front of him. So he's more like who we are today. You know, we are, men's are pretty overpaid, pretty pretentious. Look at my car, look at my girl. You know, we're a little like, like this, but the girls are ruling the world, yeah. in fact. They're ruling the house. They say, yeah, yeah, sure, but they know what they're doing. And I try, I want to have that in the film, like a modern couple of today uh, in the film. They're giving me the rap, but I have to ask about Rihanna. How awesome did she do for you? She, she was perfect from day one, totally, uh, totally generous, totally give herself to the thing, tell me what to do, what do you need, not playing the star at all, let all the entire entourage outside of the set, 
she was like, I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe that she was so generous, in fact. Good to hear. I can't wait for part two and Lucy too. <laughs>